What's up everybody, it's your boy Duty back again with another video. Today I'm actually going to be doing a video on Wings of Redemption. I know it's been a long time, but I decided with the recent update and changes to his channel, it warranted a video. Uh, so it's going to be very similar to my video I did on DSP and gifted memberships. Uh, this will be, a, it, it'll be very similar. So essentially, as most of you guys know that follow Wings of Redemption, uh, he recently enabled, uh, he recently enabled uh, memberships on his channel. Uh, he's been on YouTube for over uh, a year. And for some reason, he just decided, nope, I'm not going to have memberships. I'll just stream and live off of tips, um, super chats, and ad revenue. But, you know, it's been rough for our boy lately, uh, financially. So he's been streaming a lot lately and just hasn't been getting the revenue he needs to sustain his lifestyle. Uh, so on Saturday, he made the decision, I'm going to enable that memberships. And on a stream on Saturday, that was the first thing he talked about. He talked about how he enabled it. He talked about the cost, which is $4.99. It's just one tier. And what you get. So essentially, you, what you get is, well, you don't get much. But you do get uh, member badges, which essentially is just his logo uh, in different colors. So as long, long every month you, you're there, you get a different color batch logo. It's kind of like the crowns that DSP does. Uh, you get early access to his videos, which uh, I'm not sure what that is because he's probably he's only I think posted one video ever um, in probably the last year or so. So I'm just not sure what he's talking about there. But, you know, anyway, and the big thing is you don't get banned, no ban from chat. So essentially, if you remember, you can um, you can talk as much as you want on chat. Uh, without the fear of getting banned. You can troll them, you can say whatever you want, uh, as long as it's not racial or, or any of that stuff. If you want to troll, it's perfectly fine. It's not an issue. That's the promise that you get. And that was the main reason why I actually clipped him as that, you know, his, or his, his, his promise. I clipped it and I made a short of it just in case our boy uh, Wings decide he's going to get angry and ban someone in chat that's a member. So... You have it there. If uh, the issue is that he does ban you and you're a member, uh, you can go to YouTube and, and file a complaint. That that was the reason why I did it. So anyway, on Saturday, our boy Wings was uh, trying to kind of hype up memberships a little bit. Um, and he ended up getting 28 members that day, which I hate that to me. That sounds great. Uh, he's not he's not in the beta for gifted members, so people can't buy uh couldn't buy, buy memberships, I'm, and I'm guessing that's probably why his was a lot lower than DSP. Um, but he wasn't happy. You could tell it just bugged him a bit that he didn't get more. He thought he was going to get a couple hundred, uh, and it would be just worth the harassment that he would get in chat. Um, so you could tell towards the end of the stream he's getting annoyed and stuff. So uh, yesterday he didn't he didn't stream yesterday. I, no, he didn't stream yesterday, and today he decided to stream. And today he was just not a happy camper. And I'm not sure why. Um, I, I kind of know why, but he just was having a bad, bad day. Uh, and I believe he actually did ban someone that's a member for asking a question. Uh, I believe that person was a member. I was trying to go back in to look to see if they had that membership. I, I and I believe they did. Uh, I'm, I'm not fully sure. I'm not 100%. So, but I, but I think it was. Uh, but anyway, uh, the person that asked a question about memberships and, and, and uh, he, 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 Wings had a different tone and he started backtracking on some of the things that he, he promised on Saturday, you know, when people were initially becoming members. Uh, so I want to play that clip real quick and then I'll talk about it a little bit more. Hey, Connor. Infiltrator, why would anyone donate when you openly admit they're not putting in effort? I mean, like, see, this is why I didn't want to turn memberships on. Right here. Because I, I told you in advance, there was going to be no effort going towards the memberships. People still wanted them on, so they're on. Right, go ahead and ban Stu, please. Now, that's a lie right there. That's a contradiction. He didn't say that on Sunday. On Sunday, he basically said... This is what he was going to do, and this is what he was going to offer, and that he was going to be offering more, especially around content, where he said that he would be posting more videos. He did talk about the one video he has up there that he did a couple days ago, kind of a vlog, 
and that he was going to kind of do more of that stuff. Um, but now, I guess since he's having a very bad day, he is kind of trying to fall back on that. And if you notice, he says, uh, today, he says, you know, this is why I didn't want to turn on memberships. So the fact that he did turn it on on Saturday did not get a big influx of members to people that be, to become members. And being that people are spamming him, trolling him on chat, it's just getting to him. And I knew that was going to be the case. There was no way that Wings would live up to the whole, uh, you can spam in chat or troll in chat and I won't ban you. That's not going to happen. He's so thin skinned that he, you know, like today, today he was having a very bad day because people were team sniping him, uh, screen sniping or whatever, the, whatever he calls it on rainbow. And he was just not having a great time and not a great, you know, great session. And he was just banning people right and left, you know, didn't care why or who the person was, whether they were a member or not, he was just banning them. And he was just having a terrible day. So there's a little bit more to this clip where, uh, someone, someone is on his team and actually team kills him. And based on reading the chat, he was asking people, Hey, do you know, anybody want to play whatever this person was picked up and played. And I know he typically gives priority to members that, that that's what he's doing. So I, I, I think I'm not hundred percent sure, but I think this guy was a member. So this guy joined the session and of course, you know what you, we know what's going to happen. So let's, let's play that a little bit. All right, go and team kill fake trees, please. Dude, I knew it was going to happen when he turned on his mic. Are you wings of redemption? Fake trees, don't talk to me. You're going to get team kill three rounds in a row. Might as well leave now. Are you wings of redemption? Let's fucking go. Are you? Oh, I suck. I want to down again. Bro, I want you to video this man. I'm a huge fan. Mm-hmm. Oh, fuck. What do? We're probably gonna lose every game. I'm cold hold me because like my my games just are just random steam kill me and we end up being down eight people or some shit like that. Uh maybe if we get a full squad we'll have a good game. I doubt it. Okay, so he ended up getting uh, team killed by someone that joined, you know, that was on session. And I believe the guy was a member, if I'm not mistaken. I think the guy had asked, hey, can I join? I believe the guy, I was watching the stream and he picked him up. And sure enough, he, he just he team sniped him. And Wing was just, just not happy. I didn't record the whole clip, everything. I just wanted to kind of show a little bit of, of what we were seeing here. Um, so yeah, so the reason why I wanted to kind of show it is that, you know, this is his third day with memberships active. He hasn't gotten a big influx of, of members, uh, joining and it's just bothering him. And now that people are in chat stating, Hey, why should we become members? Well, you're not offering anything. Oh, uh, you're not putting any effort. Now he's saying, Oh, well, I said that from the very beginning. Anyway, I wasn't going to be putting any effort. I just, I enabled memberships just because people wanted it. And that's that that's a crap nobody nobody pays for membership uh or nobody asks for memberships uh for nothing they want you to give them something in return you know that's a big reason why i haven't turned on memberships on my screen because i don't feel like anything i provide to uh, my viewers is warrants any any money i mean i get okay i get the occasional uh super chat and people watch my ads and that's cool and that, that's all good you know if i can figure out a way to offer people uh, something of value. I may activate memberships in the future, but right now I, I just don't, I don't see it, you know, and I don't like paywall and stuff either, to be honest. So anyway, that, that, that's enough about me. But the reason why I want to talk about this is that because I, I really think this is just going to turn out to be a disaster for uh, Wings. Wings does just not, Wings does not have the mental fortitude to, to, uh, be a streamer he just he doesn't have the skin the thick skin to, to 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 deal with all the trolling uh 
he has no passion for it. He essentially just streams for money. You know, he, he says that all the time. He just does this the paycheck. He's just putting in his hours until he can eventually retire or milk it until it dies. The streaming, his streaming computer dies. Um, and people, uh, he's a train wreck. And that's most of his viewers that actually go to his streams are, are just there to watch a train wreck. Uh, you know, and it's free. You don't have to pay anything. So what's the that's the reason of, of buying a membership? So uh, I think the fact that he was under the impression that, you know, he's always under the impression that he's more popular than what he, think, he thinks he is. Uh, he's very much like DSP. He probably has maybe 50 to 100 actually hardcore followers that like him. But the rest of them are trolls, detractors, people that just watch the, to, 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 to laugh at him. To, to, to harass him that that's his bulk of his his fan base most of the super chats that he get on stream they're just troll troll messages you know people just put stuff out there uh to make kind of fun of him and have him actually read it you know because he can ignore the chat but he, you know he, he everybody reads the super chat and, and and i think he has to read the super chat if it's a certain amount so <clears throat> I really think membership are, you know, just on his such, he has such a weak psyche um, and mental fortitude that I envision the whole membership thing being a disaster for him. I envision him losing his stuff. I think he's going to be on stream and he's going to just explode. He's going to be so annoyed with the detractors uh, that the members that are just harassing him and poking fun at him and he's going to end up banning someone or banning several people that are members and then of course the chat's just going to explode with you said you weren't going to ban members why are you banning members and he's just going to go off he's going to start screaming at uh the viewers he's going to tell them to leave he's going to tell them i don't want just membership it's just going to be a big disaster and then he's going to leave for a couple days What's going to end up happening is people are going to report him. People are going to reach out to YouTube and essentially say, hey, I paid for a membership. This is what he offered. And he did offer the, you know, no banning, you know, if you're a member in chat and he banned me. And that's going to be a problem because when you make that a perk and you don't offer that perk, uh, you run afoul with, with YouTube. And what's going to happen is YouTube may remove um, memberships from you know from him having the option of memberships and refunding everyone which is going to annoy the hell out of him um or they may they may uh suspend them for a bit uh for for doing that uh i know that youtube is very uh their tls is very specific when it comes to um memberships super thanks that type of stuff they're very specific because they don't want it to go out of control they don't want to constantly deal with um, unsatisfied members that were promised something and never, um, never received it. Very that, that that's a huge that was a huge problem with Patreon, where Patreon actually got sued by several people because of it because their their content creators that have Patreons were promising all these things and never received never received even any of it or half of it. Uh, so I know YouTube doesn't want to have that issue. So I can envision YouTube just basically dropping the hammer on on, on wings and saying, uh, look, you promised this. Uh, you're not fulfilling it. So we're just going to um, give those members back their money and we're going to inactivate the inability, the inability for you to be member to, to provide memberships. That's probably what they're, what they're going to do. Um, and if he and if he really goes off on his stream, he may get a. He may get a, a suspension for that as well, which is just gonna, uh, which is just gonna, which is gonna just cause more drama to occur with our with our boy Wings. So, um, I really think it was just a bad idea for him to add membership. I think he 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 he's very much like DSP, where he, you know he, he can't think he can't think two steps or three steps ahead and say, okay, what are the pros and cons of activating membership? Am I gonna really benefit from this? Are people really interested in this? Do I give enough content uh, to warrant a membership? And you know, and also he has to think about his, his his mental, you know, his mental capacity right now. Can he deal with people complaining that he's not streaming enough, he's not uh, doing enough videos or early access videos, uh, that he's banning people, and it's going to be the whole, it's going to be Twitch all over all over again for him. So like the last two years of Twitch. Or yeah, about the last three, actually about the last three years since uh, Call of Duty World War Two, 
it was a disaster for him on Twitch. Every single day was just him complaining, him bitching, him worrying about. That. I mean, you've everybody's seen the videos where he goes off and basically yells at people for liking Call of Duty and making him play this horrible game. And the only reason why he does it is because if he doesn't play it, his memberships are going to drop on on Twitch. And those were just disastrous streams. I, I think he caught a couple suspensions because of it because people reported him. Um, and he's going to run into the same problem on YouTube. And it may be even it may be even worse uh, now because when he did Twitch, he had a couple things to fall back on. He had YouTube ad revenue. He also had, um, which, which was a lot. He had YouTube ad, ad revenue. Uh, he had his memberships on Twitch. Um, and then he had a side hustle with DoorDash and stuff like that. He, he no longer has DoorDash. He no longer has Twitch. He, he he deletes most of his streams because he worries about people reporting him and, and, and YouTube banning him. So all he really has is just super chats and, and tips. And tips aren't much. Uh, he rarely gets tips. He gets super chats, which, of course, YouTube takes their 30% cut of that. Um, so I think what's going to happen is it's just going to, it's going to just, it's going to steamroll really fast for him. Uh, I, I think when I made my video on DSP, I think DSP is a little bit more long-term with how, uh, the, um, how the memberships and gifted memberships are going to hurt him, uh, just because it's just going to take away from his tips for wings. I think it's just going to be, he's just going to lose it. He, he's not, he's going to have a very bad day one day. He's going to come stream and then people are going to be complaining about memberships and he's either going to just inactivate the memberships, which he'll probably do. He'll probably just go on and say, I'm, I'm turning them off. I don't care. And then of course, chat is just going to explode. More people are going to make videos on that and <laughs> that's going to upset him. Uh, and it's just going to steam, right? I really think it's going to be bad. And then what's going to happen is people are just going to complain to YouTube and they're going to get a lot of complaints. Uh, from members and non-members uh, and it, it's just going to steamroll for our boy Wing so I personally think he shouldn't have act he shouldn't have activated memberships he should just keep doing what he's doing make videos and post videos and try to get some ad revenue from that and just call it a day um, but I guess you know when, 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 when the bank account is dry and you know you want that uh, uh well, what's that truck he always talking about? Not the Ford Raptor, but the other, the Chevy one, the Trail Balls. When you want a Trail Balls, you know you're gonna have to put up with crap. And I guess he figured, let me, let me, let me earn all the money I can earn as quickly as I can earn it. Um, but you know that's not always the best option. Sometimes it's, it's just keep a low profile, do what you're doing, get your money, and then just get out, or, or find another way of making money. Uh, and I think our boy Wings really needs to just retire streaming or just make it a very part-time thing where he does it once a week or whatever and get a real job. He really needs to just go and get a real job. Just like our boy DSP, he needs to go get a real job too. But um, I think Wings more, Wings Wings actually more, he, he really needs to, to for his mental uh, sanity, I think he really needs to just, just give it up. So, all right, boys, that's it. Hope you liked the video. I will talk to you guys in the next one. Peace out.